when it was known that God would slay all the firstborn children in the land of Egypt, Moses called all the elders of Israel together. Men of Israel, this is what you must do to protect your families. Select lambs for yourselves according to the number of people in your families and kill them. Take a bunch of hyssop and dip it in the blood from the lamb and touch with it the lintel and two doorposts. And when he sees the blood on the lintel and on the two doorposts, the angel of death will pass over the door and not enter your houses. Men of Israel, hear me. You shall observe this rite as an ordinance for you and your sons forever. And when you come to the land which the Lord will give you, as he has promised, you shall keep this service. At that, the people bowed their heads and worshipped God. Lifting their heads, they returned to their homes to begin preparing for the Passover. I do hope you are following Moses' instructions correctly, Iser. I don't know what I'd do if anything happened to our Nebat. Here are the hyssop branches, Father. What are they for? We're going to dip them in this basin of blood from the Passover lamb and put the blood on the doorposts and lintel, just as the Lord our God has commanded us to do. Why should we do that, Father? Because, Nebat, just as your name means one who has experienced mercy, so it is that we Israelites are going to experience mercy. You know how Pharaoh has treated us, and how he'd not let us go out to worship our God, how Moses and Aaron told him that God would punish him for his stubbornness? But today, Moses told us that the punishment would be that the angel of the Lord would pass over Egypt and slay all the firstborn in the land, from the firstborn of Pharaoh to the firstborn of the captive in the dungeon. Even me, Father? Even you. But the Lord our God told Moses that he would spare us and our flocks, if we obeyed him and put the blood on the doorpost so that when the angel passes over tonight, all that are in the house will be safe. Father! Father! What's wrong, Nebet? Are you all right? I, I had a terrible nightmare. What did you dream? I, I dreamt... I dreamt an angel with a fiery sword was coming down our street, and and he stopped outside our house, and and there wasn't any blood in our door, and he came in, and oh, are you sure, Father? Is the blood still on our doorpost? Of course, I'm sure. You don't have a thing to worry about. I can't help worrying, Father. The Lord has given His promise, son. The Lord never breaks His word. Now you just go back to bed. Everything is going to be quite all right. At midnight, the angel of the Lord smote all the firstborn in the land of Egypt, from the firstborn of Pharaoh who sat on his throne to the firstborn of the captive who was in the dungeon, and all the firstborn of the cattle. Oh, He's dead. My son is dead. And all because you would not let the Israelites go to worship their god. Oh, for my sake, as your wife, the queen of Egypt, let the Israelites go! Be still! It is I who make the decision. <laughs> my son, the child I've been training to take over my throne, is dead. Even I, the great and mighty pharaoh of Egypt, have no power against their god. I... What more grief can Israel's god cause? Will... Will he kill me next? Uh, I, I will send the Israelites away to worship their God. Rise, Moses and Aaron. Go forth from among my people, both you and the people of Israel. And go, serve the Lord, as you have said. Take your flocks and your herds and be gone. Bless me also. And the 
Egyptians were urgent for the people to send them out of the land in haste, for they said, We are all dead men. And the children of Israel did according to the word of Moses. And they asked of the Egyptians jewels of silver and jewels of gold and raiment. And the Lord gave the people favor in the sight of the Egyptians, so that they gave unto them such things as they required. In this way the Israelites received payment for their years of servitude. And all the children of Israel made preparation to depart out of the land of their bondage. <laughs> 